Commencement of a New Life, a dramatic bedtime story reading for the Discord RP bot. Once there was a rich man. He had earned the money by doing hard labor. He had a son named Karim. He often used to say to his son, Karim, you are my only son. All of my wealth is yours. There is none to share the wealth with. The one to share the wealth you are supposed to increase the wealth with hard labor and should not waste. Don't worry, father. I will not waste the money unnecessarily, Karim would assure his father. But his assurances were false. He had fallen in a company of bad friends. He used to waste money in drinking, gambling, and enjoying dances. His friends were very happy and used to flatter him for liberally spending money on them. He would also like their, he would also, he also like their flattery and be ready to spend more money on them. When his father came to know about bad habits, he was badly upset. He thought, if he continues to waste money like this, I would soon be penniless. So I will talk to him today to mend his ways. When Karim returned home, his father said, My son, I have come to know that you waste money in a bad company. Stop doing all this and pay attention to the business. You will be spoiled like this. There is still time for you to put yourself on the right path. Karim nodded his head and firm. He did not change his bad habits. He continued to waste money on gambling, drinking, and joining dances with his blood friends. Seeing his son sunk into bad habits, the father fell ill. His was going from bad to worse. One day, when he felt that his end was near, he called his son and said, Karim, you are not on the right path, yet my life is on the verge of its end. This is a la my last advice to you. Don't waste my hard-earned money, otherwise you will always repeat repent this. Father, I will follow your advice. Do not worry, I will improve myself, said Karim with grief. You can think of your good or your bad self, but someday you find you find in trouble and open the door of the room, you will find some relief there. Saying this, he pointed towards the closed room of the house. After a few days, the rich man died. Krim felt sad for some time, but soon he forgot his loss and his old bad habits. After the death of his father, the home became a place for their enjoyment. Being heavily drunk, when Krim lost his senses, his friends would steal money from his shelves. Thus, he began to lose his money quickly. Krim was not aware of the activities of his friends. They continued to cheat him by stealing his money. Krim never doubted them and continued to spend recklessly on his friends. Soon his money vanished. His friends stopped coming to his house. They even refused to talk to him. Now, Krim did not know what to do. He recalled the advice of his father. He printed, suddenly remembering all about the closed room. He thought, perhaps father has kept his money for, kept money for emergency. He went up to the room. Upon opening the room, he was taken aback. There was a noose hanging from the roof. Paper was also attached to it. Karim was desperate, having lost all hope for money. He took the paper and began to start a new life. Then this new Karim was de desperate, having lost all hope for money. He took the paper and began to start a new life. And this noose is meant for you. Before hanging, before hanging, test the capability of the noose. Is it strong enough for your, your weight or not? I will start a. That is a dark, dark gift from the father. Sorry, I'm breaking character, but you know, also the writing's not exactly perfect. But I'm getting distracted here. Focus! I will start a new life instead of hanging myself to death. He came out of the room thinking what he should do. He kept thinking for some time. Suddenly he felt very hungry. There was nothing to eat in the house. He went to the market and sold his cap to buy milk and bread to eat. He also felt thirsty, so he kept the milk and bread on a stone and went to a nearby well to drink the water. When, our, when, when, when he returned, he saw a dog running away with his bread, having spilt the milk. He felt shocked to see this. Feeling too helpless to do anything, he burst into tears. He was very hungry, had no money to buy food. So he thought, now there's no other way except asking his friends for help. Despite being very hungry, he walked towards his friends in hopes of getting the food. He reached one of his friends and said, Hello, friend. I am starving. Give me some food. And said, Karim, I am no longer your friend. Thereafter, he went to another friend and asked for food. He too threw him out of the house, one by one. Went to all his friends. None gave him any food. Desperately, Karim returned home. He was in great despair and thought, now I should commit suicide by hanging. This is how I can get rid of my troubles. Wow, this is a depressing bedtime story. Thinking of this, Karim pulled the rope on the to see whether it was strong enough to hold his weight. As he applied force, the rope broke up. After breaking of the rope, a bag fell to the ground. Karim picked up the bag and quickly opened it. He was surprised to see that the bag was full of gold coins. There was also a slip in the bag which read, Do not finish your life. Start a fresh life with the help of this money. But first, you have to change your habits. Karim said to himself, This time I promise to myself that I will leave all bad company anymore since all my friends have cheated me. Had I followed your advice earlier, I would have been very I would be very rich today. Karim started his business afresh with the help of the wealth found in the bag. 
soon his business flourished. He started earning lots of money. Some of his friends came to meet him, unknowing about his prosperity, but Kiram refused to entertain them. Now he had come to know the difference between right and wrong. At least it ended positively. Second there, I was about to hang myself. I'm like, my god, that was depressing. Anyway, thank you, folks.